closer. Come a little closer. Stay a while. I'm Danica Quinn for Tinsel on the Town. Thank you so much for continuing to watch the Insider Scoop here at the Green Door for Aspen the Series. And I heard that you had a chance to improvise quite a bit, which was fun. Yeah, we got to make stuff up and play around, but the writing was really tight, so it wasn't... Ooh, we stayed pretty on course. Yeah. I'm the singer. Oh, you're the singer! She's the voice behind behind the whole thing. Okay, so had you guys worked together before? Yes, we're actually working on my next record. And, uh, and yeah, CJ wrote this incredible song for the show and said if I'd be interested in singing on it, which is really cool. It's so neat seeing it all come together. Awesome. I loved it. I thought it was written very well. Lawrence Levy, amazing writer. So It was so good. What did you think about the, the final product? I was so nervous for my dance number because I'm, I'm not a dancer. It's a big dance number. Yeah, and they like had to do this whole dance number and they wanted to hire a dancer and a singer for the part and nobody told me until like the audition, the very final audition. And then I, you know, I just sort of did it. Did you have to do it for the audition? Yes, I had a dance I had a dance off with another actress. I was out of my mind and I just did it and it worked. So that scoop is that we're we you know, we're hopefully I think Greg has already written like 10 episodes in and we have a whole series if, if it gets picked up and uh, hopefully it will be because everyone's awesome. Thank you. But most of my television has been drama and I love comedy and I love doing the comedy but I haven't been cast in comedy a lot so this has been just such a delight for me because you can ask my wife, I'm a very, very funny guy. So you are a little jokester. I'm sure I could find you on stage some night, you know, at comedy club or something, doing stand-up, right? Uh, no, that would not be the case. But yes, I've done a whole bunch of writing on, on shows. So they they brought me in and they gave me some food and I gave them a few... Uh... The food is the best, right? <laughs> That's the only reason to come in. That it was my favorite part in school. Was it? Lunch. Yeah. Lunch. <laughs> now, speaking about being a part of the comedy, what was that like to work with such incredible comedic actors? Yeah, it's pretty... At first you feel a little intimidated, you know, because you have people who are like headlining at the Laugh Factory. You have people who have, have reputations for doing, for being really funny people, you know. You have, you know, people like Bodie Elfman who, you know, who are like recognizable names and stuff, you know. And, and you know, you kind of have to just walk into it and say, okay, I'm going to push this all aside and I'm just going to think about what the circumstances are, you know, and who am I in this, in this scene and, and it, this is where you rely on the, ri on the writers, you know. Anything that you could share with that? It's a nude musical. You knew that though, right? <laughs> a nude musical, That's huh? That's all I can say. <laughs> I'm Timothy Fielding and you're watching Actors Reporter. Wow, what an exciting night. We met a ton of really great people. It just was absolutely a blast. I'm very excited to see Aspen this series, so be sure to keep a lookout for it. I'm Danica Quinn, here with Tinsel on the Town. We're gonna party at